everyone, how's it going? My name is April and this week I'm gonna show you how to make a three-piece loungewear set. Let's get started. I purchased two yards of soft knit fabric for this project. Then using a pair of flared pants I have at home, I folded the front of it in half and lay it on the folded fabric. Then trace out the shape. You can use any pair of pants you have at home. If you don't have flared pants but want to flare it out, you can do so by bringing the line out from the knees. After tracing the front, fold the back side of the pants in half and trace it out as well. Add your waistband seam allowance at the top for whatever size your elastic waistband will be and then cut it out. Next, lay the front pant legs out and place the back pant legs on top so they're right sides together. Then sew the inner leg seam closed. You can sew with a stretch stitch, zigzag stitch, or even a straight stitch, but just make sure to increase the stitch length. I recommend stretch stitch because it'll stretch with the fabric and it creates a really strong seam. For me, I'm just going to be using my serger. Open up the pieces and face the two pant legs right sides together. And now we can sew the crotch seam closed. Next, flip the pieces over and it should look like pants now. We just have to sew the side seams closed. I realized I closed up the first side seam kind of confusingly when you can just keep the pants flat, but there's no right or wrong way, so just do what works for you in the moment. Next, cut and sew together a piece of elastic that fits your waist. It should be 2-3 to three inches smaller than your waist measurement. Evenly mark the sides of the elastic and the center front and center back. Then match it to your pants. Pin it in place and then sew the elastic along the edge with a serger or zigzag stitch. Once the elastic is secured, flip it over and hem it on the sewing machine. Lastly, I trimmed the pants to fit me and hemmed the bottom. With what's left of the fabric, I trimmed the scraps away and we'll be using the rest to create a simple cardigan. This cardigan is super easy. All you have to do is fold in the corners evenly like this. Clearly, I still have too much fabric, so I need to cut some away so the opening can be smaller. My opening was about 8 inches. Then I can cut the extra material away. Next, fold in the corners again and mark the armhole size on both sides. Face each of the sides right sides together and sew up until the armhole marking.
Afterwards, you can go ahead and hem the armhole. With the scraps that were left from the pants, I thought it would be enough to create a border around the front opening of the cardigan, but the pieces weren't big or long enough. I needed at least twice the amount to go around the whole jacket, but since I only had half of that, I thought I would still add it on so it looked like a collar. It turned out okay, and I actually wish I didn't add it on, but oh well. With the last full piece of fabric I have left, I'm going to make a cropped tank top. I folded the fabric so the shoulder seams will be on fold and traced the tank top. I recommend tracing the higher neckline and cutting it out on both sides and then going back to trim the other side lower. Face the tank top right sides together and sew the side seams closed. Lastly, hem the neckline, armholes, and bottom of the tank with a stretch stitch. This knit material didn't give me a hard time so it was easy to just fold over the edge and hem without using any stabilizer. But if you do notice that your knit has a ripple effect, I would add some stabilizer. And I'm finished! Here is the finished 3-piece loungewear set. The knit fabric I used is so soft and stretchy, it really just feels like I'm walking around in a blanket. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. As usual, don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!